Hey there, this is Matt once again. What about to know the video? And I don't really do these a whole lot because I don't really buy a whole lot of stuff. But I wanted to showcase since this came in the mail today, I'm filming on October 12th. I don't know when this will be uploaded. Um, this came a lot earlier than it was supposed to because I ordered from their website the complete series of Elf from Shaw Factory. So I guess I have not looked at it yet, so it's not, this is not a review. It's just a first impression of the packaging. This is a sitcom from the 80s that I'm a fan of. The deluxe edition, it says. I'm pretty much just showing up close of what it looks like. And as you see there, it says... Restored footage not seen since the original broadcast. That's the main reason why I got this. It also has the cartoons, Project Elf, and some new interviews and even some commentaries. Which, of course, like I said, I have not looked at it yet, so this is not a review. So, yeah, the box. I don't. <clears throat> I guess it's okay. Something about it feels a little bit flimsy, but I guess it's okay. Now it's in these three. Now I get why people say, why don't you put them on Blu-ray? Yes, these were filmed on VHS tapes. So there's no way they did them in better HD quality. But people would say, well, it's not about that. It's about, it'd be a lot less of, of this. Like, it'd be, you could put more on a disc because it's a Blu-ray disc. So I get what people mean by that. But, anyway, so you have season, I guess, one and two. This is the cover there. The spine. I do like that each of these at least have a different color scheme. Red, yellow, and blue. <laughs> kind of like Star Trek. Because I had the Star Trek DVDs, like season one was yellow, season... One of them was, like, when Star Trek first got on DVD in these box sets, one was red, one was blue, one of them was yellow. So, I don't know. Kind of remind me of that. There's a spine. Try to wear that the back is just a picture. There's, like, nothing on it. Uh, it does have an episode list in the sleeve. So, you could take it out. At least I'll tell you which episodes on which one. And I like that there's a little bit of artwork on the back. Uh, this is how it is. Uh, I don't like that there's just the same image on each one. And what the f is it? Bloody footprints? Did he murder someone? This elf just murdered someone. This is bloody footprints going to the scene of the crime. Or away from the scene of the crime. I don't know who the fuck. And see that, you know what, that's perfect. See how that disc is there? Uh, this is the weakest part of this. These feel fucking f flimsy. Like they don't stick in that well. Thankfully so far there's no scratches on it, but I kind of want to put these somehow in a different case if I can because this feels like I... I can't get it there enough for it to truly stick. Well, it feels like I can barely get this down into the damn thing. Because it feels so damn thin. That you barely get it down there for it to stand in there. Now, granted, I'm not going to be throwing around the room, but... Like, I made sure to check these... And already this just fell out, and that's not the first time that's happened, so. Uh, these should be sticking out a bit more. Like, like, okay, see, look how I just barely, it's already coming out. So, uh, this part is shit. I'll say that part is shitty. Like, what the fuck? Like, usually, like, you feel the middle, you feel that it's protruded a little bit. 
because you press down and it'll click here barely, it's like there's barely enough room for it to go down for it to click and hold there so what the fuck I mean I guess you know just be careful but I shouldn't have to especially when I have to put this thing back on so I would say that, that right now is the negative of this set is the fact that these holders it's like they barely are in to hold the disc in and I think this could have been a bit more protruded Which is funny, disc one feels a bit more protruded, but the others don't. So, that's one thing that does suck about this, I'll say that. That's just me, though. And then there we got season three and four at least they use different pictures so his footprints but now it's yellow so I guess that he killed someone this he pissed himself yeah I don't know why there's not different artwork on each one I will say this one, if, this one it feels like, well, no, nah, I lied. Some of them it feels a little bit more protrusion in the middle. Some of them, like this, not much. This I do feel a little bit more. I don't want to press too much because I don't want to scratch the fucking thing. But this one feels a little bit more, this one. And the bonus stuff nice pictures they chose there and now we got different color although the way the lighting it looks like green but I believe it's supposed to be blue but see the it looks green here I like, kind of like baby blue but here it looks green Uh, it's like supposed to be baby blue. And this to the showcase you have Alf the Animated Series, 13 episodes. Alf Tales. Well, no, it's okay. Alf the Animated Series, season 1, 13 episodes. Season 2, 13 episodes. Alf Tales, season 1, 13 episodes. Season 2, 8 episodes. I'll look back at Elf with Paul Fusto and Tom Patchett. Project Elf. Audio commentaries for four episodes. Elf, La Cucaracha, Worked My Way Back to You, and Some Enchanted Evening. And it's nice that there's, again, little artwork in the back there. Now, I didn't get the shit with the stickers and pins and all that shit I don't give a fuck about that I do I can't I don't know about the picture quality I've not looked in it this are my first impression on just the packaging I would say I don't mind the look the look has a bit of a retro feel to it I don't know what it is with the side Maybe it's the font, maybe it's something else in it. Something about the side makes it feel retro. Almost like a, not a V, almost like a VHS tape, like a big box VHS. I don't know what it is with me. I like those different pictures and color schemes. I wish the inside artwork was better, not just footprints and the same in a different color. And they're the same. Uh, the holders, I wish was a bit more secure. So they're now wandering around. 
as much. I mean, yeah, you just have to be careful like anything else, but I don't know. I think they could have done a bit better job with that. I don't want to break the fucking things to try to get them in there. Like some of these, they don't feel secure at all. Like that one, I still like. So I don't know what else I could get to put these in, just to make sure. Oh, you do do a book, which I haven't even looked at this book yet. Oh, but this is actually pretty cool. I gotta admit that it's we got a celebrity data sheet, and then some nice pictures there. You have episode guides, which is nice. I thought this is a nice addition to have episode guides. And they tell a little bit what the episode's about. Where's well, it's nice to have this. You have pictures on each of the cast members. And then again, episode guides like Season 3, Disc 1, Stop and Name Love, Alf Crashes Lynn's Date at the Drive-In. All that jazz. Good photo there of the crew. Some nice bits here, like this is the just baby for a lot of cartoon doodles here. Doodles from the desk of Paul Fusco. So that's nice to see this little addition here. People's Choice Award, 1987. So I, I like this edition here. This is nice to, to see. Even on the Elf Tales. So again, I like the effort put into this. Even get a look at some of the merchandise. And there's actually some pictures about filming Elf, Project Elf. Yeah, I don't know why they stuck with this footprint motif. I don't know why. Such a weird thing to choose. Like, why? So, so far, again, I like the book. I, I like the presentation. It's colorful. It's not a sore eye. It's simple. Doesn't have to be over-exaggerated. Because I just wish the placeholders were a bit more secure. That's that's really my one drawback so far. But I'm going to be very busy with requests, so it'll take me it'll be a while before I even start watching this. But there you go. I'm a I'm a big fan of the show, and uh, be very curious to see if these are truly the restored episodes because when these originally were released by Lionsgate in the US they were the uh, syndicate episodes so let me explain that for a bit for those who don't know when the episode was out of course they showed the full episode when it got into syndication, it had been a few bits of time, and they wanted more time for commercials. 
So instead of maybe 25 minutes or 24 minutes of the episode, we need to bring it down to now 21 or 22 minutes. So t sometimes if some episodes were longer, you need to cut out three minutes, two minutes, four minutes out of each episode. Sometimes it would be as simple as, well, the song was used, so cut that scene out with the song. Plus, we don't have to pay for the rights of the song. When Elf and the father character, Willie, father of the family, they're riding the railroad, uh, railroad tr uh, train, they get off it, and there's a whole finale with them around a campfire. That whole bit is cut out of that episode in the Lions Day DVDs. Because that's how it was cut off a syndication, because they wanted the episodes but shorter to have more commercial time. So when Lionsgate got these for their DVDs, that's the stuff they used. So you're watching, you're going, wait a minute, this is cut out, this is cut out, they used the syndicated ones? Now, these were released in Germany, which I actually do have that over there. It was nice to, you know, get them in the U.S., assuming these are it, like they say it is, and then they have, you know, the cartoons and the TV movie, and then they have some features on it. It's a pretty cool deal. I said, just get maybe the placeholders be a bit stronger. I'm trying to think of anything else. Yeah, so far, yeah, that's all I can say for now until I actually do watch it. Yeah, it'll be a long while because I'll be busy with requests, but just wanted to show case up close what these things look like to people. So. But yeah, this is, yeah, I'm a big fan of the show. So it's still nice to have. Yeah, so far still in there, so it's, it's not... So far, two egregious. Is that like flip it out every single time? Plus, you know, there's shipping as well. And you know how when... Sorry to the post office people. Sometimes you have some workers that don't know what they're doing. They just throw shit around and... Maybe you got rattled or two. But there's always that as well. But yeah, so far, for the most part... For the most part, liking what I'm seeing. But you know me, if I'm going to be critical, I'm going to be honest. So. Someday, uh, I'll, when I get the chance and time, I'll check that out and, and see, and we'll go from there. So, fair to just show that a bit. Thanks for watching. Take care, everyone. We'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.